say we have a chart like this I'm just selecting everything and I'll be recreating the chart from scratch a column chart say and you want to have a line where you feel that uh, you shouldn't go above or a target and how do we do this so the easiest way to to do this is to create a number here this is your target and then you reference it up and all the way down you've created another chart line so you just copy it and you paste it on the chart so it doesn't look good because it's columns now so what we need to do is we need to click on the new uh, series that we have created and we click on change series chart type so now showing the two series as a clustered column so we need to select the one we've just created and we put a line instead now we have created a line now if you want the line to instead of having it starting in the middle of that column here uh, what we can do is create a quote unquote dummy row here before and after we will click again on the series and we bring everything up instead of just uh, selecting this we select everything uh, so this for that leaves a room here and we select this at the bottom here so this way that would leave some room at the on the other hand and this the same for this this I want everything and then I give you a line that goes across and beyond so obviously you can format that line if you don't like the default value so you have you can change the weight but um, usually it's best to put some dotted lines and then maybe change the color to make it more obvious so that's one way to, of doing it another way that I that I like as well is um, it's a very similar but instead now you just click on this again you change the series chart type and instead of having a line here you select area now you once again you might or you might not like the color so you can still change it you can make it a little bit more subtle maybe so you can make a, a, a paler a paler color and then if I add the labels here I would uh, all the values that are 100 850 are within this area and the values that are above are above this area now if I go back to this uh, chart here this one here and say you want to remind users um, of the the threshold itself on the on the charts without him having to to guess it here what you can do is is a couple of ways so you can um, add a data label just at the last data series here for instance if it's a fixed chart you can just click twice so you select only the last one and here you select add data label so that would show it to you here now if you right click format data label then you can select where you have it so it'll be nice uh, maybe to have it at the top and here you have it you can s uh, refer to a field for this for instance you could say the label here will be the field here that is on top so here I will put for instance target is and I would add that at the end you would just click on the data label itself and you say you want to have the value of this field here and then it will show you the target is 850 and after you can format again now this system to add a target is uh, kind of obviously also being done on other types of charts here for instance I want to put my 850 back and just select all this and I paste it on the chart this way and after I do my usual formatting now another way to show the threshold and that'd be the the last way I'll be showing you today is to it's to have uh, some stacked columns so let me show you how it works now I will be creating uh, two columns first the one the columns that of the data that is under the threshold so I will just be doing a very simple formula so if the number here is above the threshold then I will put only the threshold otherwise I will put the, the field itself so this is what it would look like so if the data is above the threshold I only show the threshold and if it's uh, smaller I just show the data itself
So same thing, actually I'm just gonna completely remove this one. Insert stacked columns. So here that uh, just shows me that everything that is above Maybe that should be the other way around. Maybe this should be, oh, that's gonna hurt the eyes, but everything that is above should be red. Make it very clear that we don't like it, for instance, if it's, if it's a bad thing.